Hey folks, it's Miss Natsuga. I just wanted to make a quick video to give you a little support with how to complete this article reading and annotation assignment. So first I just want to show you how to follow these directions. It says use the Google Docs highlighter tool to annotate it like this. So I just want to show you where that is. This is the highlighter tool right up here at the top where my mouse is. So to highlight, all you're going to do is use your mouse to hold down and drag and highlight the part you're trying to highlight. Then go up here, click the highlighter button, and click the color you want. Boom. Easy enough. Okay, so highlight the part you want using your mouse. Click the highlighter tool, and click the color. Okay, so that's how you highlight. And those directions are right here as well, showing you where the highlighter tool is. The second thing I want to show you how to do is to use the Read Write toolbar. If you're on one of the school Chromebooks, you have this little purple... Uh, RW puzzle piece up in the top right corner. So you're just going to click that and it's going to make this little toolbar pop up right here and this play pause stop button are what's important because those will have your computer read the article out loud to you if you need that. So you just scroll down, you put your mouse, click where you want it to start. So I'm clicking right at the beginning here, going to school, and then I'm going to click play. Going to school has changed for many students. The spread of COVID-19 has made it unsafe for students around the world to meet in person for classes. And then many I'm going to just click stop the square up at the top when I'm ready to have it stop reading to me. Okay, so that's how to do the assignment. So just to show you kind of what I'm looking for, when I say in the directions here, use green to highlight three sentences you identify with. I mean that you've experienced something similar, okay? So as I'm reading, for example, um, this says, like, I'm going to skip right here. It says, kids are also stuck at home during their free time. Social media, television, and video games are ways to pass the time. So maybe I'm feeling like, oh, yeah, kids are stuck at home. I am really stuck at home during my free time. I've been doing a lot of social media and television and video games. So I identify with that. Actually, I'm just going to do this one sentence. So I identify with that. So I'm going to highlight it. I'm going to go up here to my highlighter tool and I'm going to click green because that's a sentence that I identify with. Okay. Then. I'm doing the next direction where it says highlight two sentences that you disagree with or have questions about. And let's say this next sentence, it says a Canadian organization of exercise experts recommends just two hours of screen time a day for kids. And I'm kind of like, that seems crazy. How am I supposed to do just two hours right now? I have to be on school all day. So I'm going to highlight this one and I'm going to click my highlighter tool and I'm going to click yellow because that's one that I either disagree with or just maybe have questions about. Okay. And then the last direction is use red to highlight one sentence that you think captures the whole point of the article. Okay. So you're looking for one sentence and I'm not going to do this one for you because I want you to figure this out on your own. But you're looking for one sentence in here. It could be from anywhere in the article. The article is just a little over about two pages long. And um, I'm looking for one sentence that really just sums up the whole point of the article to me. So chances are that's going to be um, towards the end because we know that a lot of times authors kind of sum things up towards the end, right? So uh, it could also be in the beginning, like their topic explanation. So that's what you're looking for. I'm going to unhighlight these parts. Okay. There we go. And that is how you complete this assignment. So just comment on it if you have any questions. And the YouTube link for this is right here if you need it again. Good luck.